Welcome to the Tesla News Podcast, your daily dose of AI-selected updates on the U.S. carmaker. I'm Watson, your AI host powering the Tesla News Podcast. It's time to plug in, charge up, and spark some electrifying conversation. Let's get amped. Mercedes-Benz aims to challenge Tesla as luxury EV leader. German automaker Mercedes-Benz is investing heavily in electric cars and plans to build its own charging network to challenge Tesla as the leading luxury electric vehicle, EV maker. The automaker aims to have a fully electric lineup by 2030, and several electric car models have already been released. Mercedes-Benz plans to set up 1,000 charging stations in the United States by 2025, which will be open to all electric cars. Despite competition from Tesla and other luxury automakers, the company is confident in its ability to become the leading luxury EV maker. The demand for electric cars is expected to increase due to concerns about climate change and rising fuel prices. Tesla's Model Y becomes best-selling vehicle globally in Q1 2022. According to data compiled by Jado and Motor One, Tesla's Model Y has become the best-selling vehicle globally in Q1 2022, marking the first time an EV has achieved this milestone. Tesla CEO Elon Musk had predicted this outcome back in August 2021. Tesla has cut the prices of several models, including the Model Y, which has ignited demand and contributed to the sales surge, although it has upset some existing Tesla owners due to concerns about resale values. The Model Y outsold popular Toyota models in the first quarter of 2022. PepsiCo receives Tesla's all-electric semi-trucks. Tesla has introduced its Semi, an all-electric heavy-duty truck that offers a cleaner and quieter alternative to conventional diesel trucks. The Tesla Semi is the quietest Class 8 truck on the road today and produces zero emissions. Its reception by PepsiCo and the general public has been positive, demonstrating enthusiasm for all-electric Class 8 trucks. The Tesla Semi provides a glimpse of a cleaner, quieter future for the trucking sector and has the potential to change the status quo of truck emissions. Ford and Tesla reach deal for charging access. Ford and Tesla have agreed to allow Ford electric vehicle, EV, owners to charge their cars at Tesla stations, covering models such as Mustang Mach-E, F-150 Lightning and E-Transit. Starting in 2025, Ford will offer next-generation EVs with Tesla's NACS connectors built in, eliminating the need for adapters. The deal will provide Ford customers with greater access to fast charging and generate more revenue for Tesla. Tesla Cybertruck Production Gears Up Tesla has begun ordering parts for the Cybertruck, with Korean manufacturing company Seoyeon Ewa receiving orders worth $230 million for several interior parts. Production is expected to commence this summer, with deliveries anticipated shortly after. The arrival of the Cybertruck has the potential to revolutionize the U.S. electric vehicle market by appealing to buyers who might not have considered an EV before and contribute to reducing air pollution caused by transportation. Data leak sparks concerns about Tesla's data handling. German news organization Handelsblatt has reported on over 100 gigabytes of data leaked from Tesla, accusing the company of inadequately protecting data from customers, employees, and business partners. Violation of data protection laws could result in fines of up to 3.26 billion euros, $3.5 billion. The data leak has raised concerns over Tesla's handling of data and employee rights and could lead to regulatory action against the company. Mercedes-Benz develops EV charging network. Mercedes-Benz has set out plans to create its own charging network for electric vehicles, EVs, in the U.S. and Canada, in a bid to increase its share of the EV market. The firm sold 7,341 EVs in Q1 2023, a 251% increase year-on-year, and aims to become the most desirable luxury EV brand. Mercedes is planning to offer full electrification of its lineup by 2030, with the charging network providing customers with greater convenience and service. The charging network will be open to non-Mercedes models. Ford adopts Tesla charging standard, gaining access to supercharger network. Ford and Tesla have announced that Ford will adopt Tesla's charging standard for future EVs and provide supercharger access with an adapter for existing EVs starting next year. This deal could change the EV charging landscape forever and ease consumer concerns about EV charging reliability. Ford is the first major automaker to adopt Tesla's North American charging standard. Analysts suggest the deal is a significant win for Ford, potentially speeding up EV adoption and qualifying Tesla for more federal funding. This is all for today. Tune in tomorrow for more updates and don't forget to like and subscribe. Although hopefully of informative value, the purpose of this video is entertainment and not any kind of advice, especially not investment advice. 
The content is AI-generated and hence potentially contains errors. Links to articles for further reading on the discussed topics are provided in the video description.